Hey, hi loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you guys doing? Yes, I am back with another video. If you're new here, you're welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you're returning, thanks for returning back to my channel. So in today's video, it's all about braids. Yes, we're going to braid today mostly for beginners okay guys if you are new you don't know how to braid watch this video till the end and you're gonna gain a lot so we're going to be making use of this t1b slash red in color like a kind of ombre color and very reddish so the next thing i'll be showing you is this rubber band i have it in black color and you can go to amazon you will get it there and uh, I have 1,000 pieces inside it and I'm going to show you how it looks like um, it's in black color if you like it you can go for it but I will see if this very rubber band will be good for my hair so this is the first time I'm making use of rubber band so this is the way it looks like so I went ahead and prepped my hair to get it ready to be braided this is the most easiest way you can really really braid your hair without stress just prep the hair with a rubber band and that is what i did here you can see i really don't need to start using comb all over again because i have made use of the rubber band so i will be showing you now the next thing to do in which it's just to use my rate comb to pick out some strands of hair i think that um a little more will be I think this one is too much let's just remove some that will do so uh, the next thing now is just to take our um, rubber band the the small tiny little rubber band and just use it to uh, round the hair so I have soaked it already in um, oil you can use olive oil if you wish to or hair cream so that was what i did here just to make it much much easier for me so i just use it to tie it around the hair and that was what i did for the whole of the hair so it's as easy as you can think so now that we are done um adding rubber band to the hair we'll just take um a part and just cut it open and start using it I told you guys it has been prepped already so you don't need to stress yourself using scissors to this very uh, pack so right inside each pack you have two bundles okay I doubt if I'll be using all this hair so you have two bundles like so inside so you can see it's very very a kind of should I call it neon 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 sorry guys neon red yeah because it's very very reddish at the end so just remove the rubber band then we start um, scooping out some hair or strands that we'll be using okay so this is what I normally do just divide it into two you pick a little you just grab some hair and uh, yeah like so be careful because if you let everything to scatter you won't get the the ends to be red it will be mixed with black and you don't really need that to happen to you so this is how it looks like and we're gonna start from the back just grab one from the back and you just you continue braiding okay guys
so after braiding to the tip of the hair what i did was i twisted it okay you can wash the braids closely it's very very smooth and neat so at the end of it i twisted the braids but i didn't really twist all the braids i was like enjoying twisting the end or i get tired i just do it normal braid at the tip of the hair So as you can see we are done with one pack out of it so this is the second pack in the first pack i hope you understand what i'm trying to say the second one in one pack okay that is what we are using now remember we still have two packs left So guys, I've already gone ahead to make use of the second pack in which this is the achievements for the second pack. Okay, so now we are going for the third pack. This one is the third pack, which is the last one that we have. Guys, I was so exhausted the day I was making this hair. So what I did was to give myself a break because I have other things to do. As a mother, I have things to do in the house. Okay so i just did um the little i can then i waited for the following day to continue so this is the following day me making this hair the next day of me making this hair so i made use of this hair food uh for my hair also it's very very good smells nice i got that on the local beauty store so we are just about rounding up this hair so it's just like a kind of stress when you're braiding your hair you feel pains on your shoulder <laughs> but guys i tell you it's worth it because you can't go outside and spend that much to braid your hair you know how much it costs if you are um an african you you will really understand what i'm trying to say because when you go to salon you know how much you're going to spend <laughs> but if you sit at your comfort zone at home you make your hair yes guys we are done making this hair what are we talking about so the third pack i have this left and also one full um, of half of the pack so that is what is left so we did not really finish all this um braiding extension so now it's time to seal the ends of the braids okay so i have my hot water boiled one but be very careful to make it much much easier I just like pack some strands with um, what should I call it crunches or whatever just to dip it inside you know like so to make it much much easier for you you won't get burnt when you do it this way so I pick up my uh, tile the, the dry one and just use it to just uh, dry up all the excess water coming out from it you can see how beautiful it is it's very very beautiful and that is the way you can seal the hands of your braid so i'll go ahead and finish up So now that we are done, we are going to make use of this color uh, mousse. It's meant for colored hair, but I just like to use it for my braids. So I just scoop a little and just um, saturate it to the braids. Okay, so that is what I am doing here. And also I'll be making use of this virgin hair fertilizer. It's very, very good for the roots of your hair. It smells like uh, menthol okay like menthol or mint should i say mint so that's what i normally use for my hair 
okay guys so now we are going to just try and make some baby heads so i'll be making use of this uh beautiful uh what is it called again sorry guys i skipped that edge control yeah edge control it's very very good it lays the hair uh the baby hairs very fast okay so that's what i'm trying to do here So now let me just stand up for you guys to see how long this hair is. Uh, this hair is um, 46 inches long, okay? That is the length of the hair and the weight of each pack uh, is 160 grams, okay? So you can see the beauty of this hair. They have many colors, okay? Just go on Amazon and check out their hair. They have many, many uh, colors. They have blue. I have made use of blue before and i love to use this red how do you guys see it isn't it beautiful if i can do it you can do it also Alright people, thanks for watching, I so much appreciate it and uh, yes, I have to talk about this very fast, as fast as I could. I really really uh, don't advise you to go with rubber band because this is my first time using rubber band for my hair. I tried it and I realized that it's stripping my hair off, you know, even with the oil it's really stripping my hair off so i really don't advise you to use it per se so if you want to make a kind of hairstyle in which it's like bob you know like to this length or here you can use the rubber band to tie it or maybe after burning it you can tie it that is what it's perfect for but to the root of your hair it will strip your hair off so i'm telling you now out of experience I realize it's stripping my hair off so I don't advise you to use that type of a rubber band like I don't know how to show you guys like this type of rubber band like straight kind of sharp kind of rubber band I don't know if you guys can see that you know like so it's not advisable so that is the only thing I can tell you so I am rocking my hair now. I told you guys I have a total of 130 strands of hair and I still have some left. Okay, I still have some left. So it doesn't feel heavy anyway. So if you want to like get this kind of hombre hair, you can check your local beauty store or better still you go to Amazon and check um check there you will you will get hairs like this this is ombre red okay black with red this is perfect for christmas you know christmas is red but i should have done so but i don't have to worry i might do another one okay guys i just want to show you and to tell you that you can do this i've been like thinking on how to braid my hair i do braid my hair but i was like trying to look for someone that would braid my hair but so i said to myself why don't i sit and watch Netflix then I can get busy and that was what I did so I did not use one day to make this hair I have other things to do I just paused for some time I made this hair for like 70% of the hair that I've done then 30% was finished today okay I can make it in a day I can make it in a day but I have other things to do so I won't come here to tell you that I made this hair in a day no I did it for two days okay so i have 130 strands of hair on my head 
you can see how beautiful it is. Let me zoom for you guys to see. Okay, I'm just zoom for you guys to see it. Okay. You can see how beautiful this hair is. You can see so beautiful and so luscious. I love it. So just take this hair for like maybe six weeks thereabout or four weeks if I can and um, yeah I'll just unravel it okay and I can make it a kind of short bob if I want to maybe um, short bob and yeah so so guys if I can do it you can do it so that is my everyday uh, motto if I can do it you can do it also okay guys thanks for watching i so much appreciate it if you have any question feel free to ask me leave me a comment down in the comment section okay and i'll be glad to respond